want both sides to choose that spokesperson. You can have help. It's a mediation training. It goes beyond just solving the problem. They're learning skills such as active listening. They're learning how to paraphrase and reframe. So, yeah. But what are we saying? You have to know, well, that's not okay. If it does get heated, are we able to then say, perhaps we need to take a break? The issue is sex education in the schools. What is sex ed? You know? No, but why are you against the sex ed? There'll be one side that'll be pro-sex education in the school. When I was in high school, there was a lot of teen pregnancy, so maybe giving a class like that would lower the teen pregnancy. There'll be another group that says, no, we're not for it. We should be doing it as parents at home. I'm the mother, and I was about teaching my son how, when it's appropriate. We know that you're very passionate. There's going to be two facilitators. And so what they're going to learn, if you're in a community and there are issues and there are different sides to the issues, how do you do a mediation with many people? It's not an appropriate age, and I don't think it's the time for them to learn at an elementary school. I'm glad you brought that to the attention. Sex is a sensitive topic to discuss, but why keep it that way? They're learning to read body language, to read eye and facial, as well as space communication. Many students say, well, I'm not too sure if I'm going to use this in my career, but I'm certainly going to use this when I go home. It's a great opportunity for faculty and students to interact. We're here and we're here working with them. We have four Marines. We have people that have children in their 20s and 30s, people with children that are one years old and six months old. As parents, we want our kids to be educated and sex education should not be taboo. It is very important that you should be respectful to everyone's culture. Your norm is not my norm. It is just so cool to um, be able to interact with all different types of people from all different walks of life. As a mediator now, I see you gotta hold back, listen to points of view. Before I was like, Nah, I don't, I don't like your point of view. I'm going to listen to my point of view. Having a military background desensitizes you to a lot of other people's points of views. We don't necessarily have to go and tell people how to solve their problems. Most people are capable of coming up with ways to solve their issues. You're all going to go out there and you're going to make this happen. We're here because our wonderful professors saw something in us and, and really said, hey, look, this is something that I think you would be great at. Congratulations. The baby's immediate too. <laughs> We're really proud of them. It's a labor of love. We're here because we want to be here.